But she's repentant, so let's forgive her. She said she will not support Judy again, so let's go. As we get on top the matter, now we are another matter. Sorry for the laugh. <laughs> Name is Asitonka Agri Abba and channel is called Asi Darling because I'm such a darling. <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Chagar Acid Dali. Thank you guys so much for clicking once again. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. As all my OGs, you know what to do. Comment down below. Let me know, gang, gang. Crazy things are happening. Guys, it has been a lot. Keeping up with the Doche series has been a lot. It has been a roller coaster. But first of all, shout out to the queen herself, May, on the launch of her product. She has two products that she just launched. Um, offset by Queen May, the perfume, and then Queen May black hair um, dye shampoo. You can check out her page. Congratulations, May. Wishing you lots of sales, darlings. Please go to her page. Massively, massively patronize these products. Support our queen. Let us know. Do you get the key? Mm -hmm. You understand? So now let's get to the main issue. Sarah Martins has been trending. And as somebody that has been bringing you guys updates, I think I should throw more lights on this particular saga. So let's get back to the basis. You see now, for those of you that do not know, hmm? in Nollywood, we have Asaba Nollywood. Asaba Nollywood, those ones that are always shooting movies in Asaba, Asaba Nolly. So Sarah and Judy are actresses in Asaba Nolly. And they have been friends. Way before, I think way before um, Judy and you came out with this, um, their marriage saga. So... While one thing I noticed, let's be realistic now. You know, when I'm giving you updates, I'm just giving you the truth, raw facts. One thing I noticed is, while other Judy, um, um, Jud Judy's other friends, will I say, if she had like actress friends, those top people, why they laid low when they were dragging her? You know, when the drag started, oh my God, this girl, with all the things that she did, of course. Sarah was one Hollywood friend that Judy had that was vocal. She was so supportive every time, supporting in bad character. She was saying all sorts of things. Now, for those of you that do not know, she's the kind of person that will say, Oh, um, um, husband and wife, match made in heaven. You know, she comes out, she will post Judy. There was a slide she once posted Judy. She said, Um, the lies Potiphar's wife told against Joseph led to his promotion. Every lie against you shall work in your favor. Beauty, resilient, wise, supportive, peace of mind. And why manaria asanwunye odogu judy. And this was a post she made to support her friend. Another post she wrote, never be afraid to snatch a good man from a lousy, careless woman. He, he deserves to be loved right. Same to the women. Nobody is above snatching because everybody deserves to be loved right. Out to snatch your papa. That's the kind of person she is. In case people have, you know, some people might not really know her and they'll be wondering why all these things have been happening. So I'm taking you through it. Just relax. The main points, they come. Now, we also recall that this is the per uh, particular person you know, that went to doctor a Christmas photo. And post, you know the, the photo that May did with her kids, Sarah posted a doctored image. She claims that she's not the one that doctored it. Of course, she saw it trending and she was like, oh, it's beautiful. Somebody had put Judy inside, put Stein inside and put Yule inside the picture. Do you understand? So Sarah posted it. And you guys remember we did a video where we talked about it. Yule commented, was like, yes, yeah, so this is how it's supposed to be. May Zukwanike. You get that kind of thing. It was, yeah, it was the height of mind, mind fuckery. You was, you was gaslighting me to the point of madness. That period was a mess. Now, Daddy Freeze even featured Sarah on his channel. I will attach all the clips to, to the, um, at the end of this video so that you can hear from her side when she was supporting Judio, all the things she said concerning especially this one. Now, another thing, when that story, um, when that post broke, that was, I think, the beginning of it. Oh, the, the whole madness for me, it started from there. Because remember that May now sued her for 500 million. Sued Sarah Martins. That was the first, even before she even filed for divorce. Sarah Martins was the first person she sued for defamation and all those distress. She sued her. And um, guys, remember their demands? 
the demands they wrote us to redress harm. And I told you people, I said, if I read these demands, it's not about the 500 million, but about the pain that Sarah has put this woman through. The demand to, um, to redress the harm and injuries you have caused our clients, we demand the following. An unreserved public apology to our clients, in which you will specifically admit to every material aspect of your utterances and publication uh, was absolutely false and that you have no basis to deliver such utterances and publication to be true. An unqualified ex um, exp expression of remorse for your utterances and publication, a full retraction of your utterances and publication, a commitment to the continuing effort on your part to issue clarification and correction every time your utterances and publications are repeated or reprinted, assurances that you will not repeat these utterances and or make up any false defamatory publication against our clients. When this thing broke, it seemed like, in fact, her mouth was still sharpening. After this suit, hey, she came up and said, after all, that, uh, yes, that was when she now did the video with Daddy Freeze and was talking about, no, that May's fans too are harassing her, she too, she will sue. But that's one thing with the law, it might be slow. It might look like nothing is going on. But when I saw her starting to apologize, I remember this particular lawsuit and I knew that, see, one way or the other, one way or the other, it will catch up with you, okay? Guys, let's continue. So, Sarah even shared a post um, where she was referring to May and she insisted that if uh, May doesn't want to be numbered, she should take a walk from the marriage. Who, re who remembers that? This girl was all for Judy. When they say, I know that your yeah, friends stand um, by friends and all of that, Sarah was that kind of friend. Towards Judy, you get, and this whole thing. Where this war now took a sharp left was when Sarah posted a video. You know, apparently, from the context, I didn't see what had happened. I'm going to be linking that video, but I didn't see what had happened in her comment section. But apparently, somebody had commented something vile and evil towards May's daughter. And then, the same person was the person that won a giveaway, according to the story, allegedly. So, according to her still, somebody now uh, um, kind of doctored the image of the person winning the giveaway and also put that the person was the, uh, was the one that, you know, put the vile comment the person made. And this whole thing was to insinuate that Sarah had paid the person to commit a crime. You understand? So, I'm going to be putting the clip for you guys to watch and let me know your thoughts, okay? So, watch it. Good morning. So, I woke up this morning to see people tagging me everywhere. <laughs> Saying I pay people to kill me, Iduchi's daughter. I don't understand. See, I this is the height I can take. I have tolerated enough trolls. I have tolerated insults upon insults from people for coming online to accuse me of something I have nothing. I, 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 I have nothing to do with this the height of it. How can somebody wake up? How can somebody wake up? And all you think of is evil against your fellow people. What kind of rubbish is this? I've been trying to control myself. I've been trying to control myself, but this is the height. I cannot. I, I, can't, I, I cannot take this. I can't. I can't. I can't. This, this, this is becoming. This is becoming. It is becoming too much of me. What kind of rubbish is this? What is my business with you, Ledoja, and his family? What is my business with with May's children? Or of what benefit will it be to me to to harm to harm May and her children? Am I the one married to her husband? Am I the one married to her husband? What is my business with you, Ledoja? I. I have so many problems. Why are people so miserable and wicked? Why must you drag my legs in every, every negative thing on the internet? Please, before now, I have never, ever had any issues with people. I have never, ever had any form of dragging online before. Nobody has ever dragged me online before. I have never had any sort of issues with people. You will never hear that I had issues with people. Because I'm a very, I'm a very, I like, I'm a very sweet soul. I'm a very sweet person. And this is the first time that people have been coming, but like, see, this is the past one year. Since the past one year, people have been dragging me left and right. Just love her or whatever you call yourself. Keep my name off your mouth. Stay away from me. I cannot tolerate somebody coming out. To accuse me of a tempted mother. It is evil. It is evil. It is evil. I am in love. I cannot take this. I can't take this no more. What kind of room? Why do you keep on dating my life? All you think of is destroying my life and dating my image. Why are people so 
<laughs> guys let me know your thoughts in the comment section below on her post following this she also wrote at this point i am exhausted i woke up this morning to different messages and calls from concerned friends over an alleged allegation made up um against me by juice lover and her cohort first of first and foremost i am a mother and a passionate one at that i will never wish death upon anyone talk more of someone's child if i ever thought or wish death upon anyone let it happen to me and mine i did a giveaway sometime in july on my Facebook page, Sarah Martin's TV, when, which I posted and I clearly said, I will randomly choose my winners on Facebook, which I did and one Miss Gochi Sandra was among the 10 active followers I chose and credited 5k each. Someone from the pit of hell saw where this woman had dropped an evil comment against me, um, May Yule Doche's daughter and went back to my giveaway that she won some time ago, took a screenshot of it, merged my picture to it and started circulating disgusting lies against me saying I paid her to kill Danella, the first daughter of May Doche and the evil news have been flying all over in the internet. I did uh, um, all over the internet of what benefit is it to me? To even think ill of me and her children. This is a heavy accusation and it is evil for someone to wake up and formulate such huge lie just to trend. I have no hand in this. Never have, never will. Please, you all should stay away from me. I have had enough. Note, I have never met this said lady. I do not have any form of relationship with her. She's just a fan that attacks me as fan the same way they attack me. Guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. This was what she wrote, okay? Now, when she wrote this thing, different people were bringing reactions because she was really crying and becoming very hysterical and all of that. And I know that this allegation is heavy. So I understand her, you know, her, her, her expression, okay? But we know where this, this woman has bad mouths. She came out, did a video with Daddy Freeze and was, was insulting me. So I didn't feel any type of way towards her. I didn't put that video up as at the time it was trending per se. Because there's one thing about posting in news. There's another thing about, see, over flogging people, people that just want to clout. Okay? And when she wrote this, Rita Edoche now posted something. Hey, you people know Rita Edoche is the one that has... Proposed in her heart that you see the place that she put leg on top of uh, Judy's neck. For <laughs> the place that she put her leg on top of Judy's neck, Judy and Yu's neck in their in their home. That's that is where that, that leg will be. Rita Edoche is somebody that you need though, on your side, especially those of you that are entering some kind of funny homes. Rita Edoche is the is the in-law. Is the in-law that you need. I was like, wow, you don't have any business with Yu's family yet. Number one. She started listing her sins because people know <laughs> Rita Edoche does not joke. She said, you said Queen May should leave her matrimonial home if she doesn't want to be numbered. And remember that she talk amu, said her talk amu. Mm -hmm. Number two, you said Queen May went to London with another woman's husband. In that her daddy freeze, I think, life. Somebody said it was among that. I didn't even bother to watch it because that's just a bunch of lies. The third one, he said, the truth of you let Duchess reason for getting a second wife will soon come out. In which you let her said Queen May cheated on her husband. That's number three. Number four, you also, you always addressed her as a bad maid queen. Number five, your first time under the freeze life, you said Queen May is not a good wife to Yule Doche. You said a lot. You said Judy has been the one taking care of Yule, which is why he went ahead to marry her. The other day, you made Queen May Doche's family picture with Judy's own, saying as it should be. Still, you don't have any business with Yule's family. Let me ex you were listening. You were, you were, you were explain tire, according to her. But my own is you people should not allow me come live to talk this issue. Because if I do, hmm, a lot will go wrong. Guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. I believe that at this point, you uh, Rita in the church should just come out and say something. Because it is so funny how much she knows. And if she does, it's going to be messy. It's going to be messy. Now, one thing I want to even pick out from this thing she said... You know when people always feel like, yes, there's something that me should have done that made um, uh, um, you go for Judy because, of course, uh, uh, Judy. Maybe Judy is the one taking care of him. Or he comes to the set. He's looking at that. Everybody's partner or spouse has the, has the ability to look less privileged, to look like they're suffering in their house. All these things. And you, you're feeling like uh, the savior. You have this hero mentality. That savior complex that is worrying some people. <laughs> Be careful, though. Be very careful. I'm telling you the truth. Be very careful. Let nobody deceive you. Be very careful. Now, sure you see that this girl was shouting and crying about how she was sorry in her picture and everything. 
So when um, uh, Rita Idoche posted this, guess what she did? She went, she took time out from her tears. She took some time from her tears to reply her. She said, Rita Idoche, whatever you call yourself, keep my name off your mouth. I know you love cloud chasing and you study cloud chasing, but kindly do not get my name involved. I have never directly or indirectly bullied me Idoche on my page. So before you accuse me of bullying, please come correct. Screenshot where I mentioned her name on any of my posts or shut the hell up. She went on to say, Madam Rita Idoche, let this be the first and last time you will mention my name on those your wrinkled mouths. Screenshots and posts where I mentioned Mayor Doche in your listed accusations or shut the hell up. If you want to come for me, please come with receipts. Evil people will, are always fast to attach people's names to posts that has nothing to do with them. I have never bullied or trolled me um, after my public apology to her over the doctored picture I shared as a third party. You can feel free to assume whatever you want from my innocent cruise post. That's entirely your business. Until I mention her name and make a post, then you can boldly hold me accountable as a bully. But until then, stop cloud chasing with my name. Take, the, take my video down from your page. Trust people. As she dropped this thing, eh, you know, rich grand trust people to drag her because this is this is the height of mannerlessness. Rita Doche is not your friend, it's not your level, she'll not be your mate. She's not even your friend is Judy. Judy is not even Judy is married to her, her nephew in law. I mean they call that they call like it's just like where, where, where is you on the grand scheme of things? Do you understand how weird it is that you're having the mouth? So call somebody that should remove your name from her wrinkled mouth. So her fans went on, dragged Sarah Martins to pieces, dragged her to pieces. Now, one thing I need to let you guys know, note that when all this was happening, neither you nor Judy came to her defense. That is where this story now, the boiling point has reached. Do you get that kind of thing? Nobody came to her defense. It was like she was, she was fighting as a struggling wounded lion, but she was still, you know, struggling and fighting. That question should be directed to you, you himself, to answer. I can't come and tell you what Yule Doche is all about. That's not... That, that's... Do you know why? Sorry? Because of that picture. Do you know why I'm directing it to you? Because okay. of that picture. That's why. Yeah, I saw that picture somewhere on Facebook. I, I wasn't the one that actually uh, uh, oh, photoshopped the whole the thing. No, it yeah, was trending. I, I saw it as well. It was trending. Thank you. Very, I saw that picture somewhere rant on Facebook. And I loved the way uh, 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 my girl, Judy, you know, was attached to the picture. And I was like, wow, I just wish they, like, you know, the entire family can actually gather together and take a family picture as cute as that. That was my attention. I never meant to disrespect anybody at oh, all. You have, if, if that is what your intention was, then you have no problem. Um, online and be fighting against somebody i call my friend definitely i should be there to support my friend that's what i'm doing i'm mm -hmm. only supporting my girlfriend yes if you were to be my girlfriend okay and you're having you know like online fights and all and, and all that i should be there as your friend to protect you and to fight for you and to fight with you as well so can that's I what i'm doing can i, ask you I have question, no problem with nobody okay can i ask you one question if you don't mind sis Sure, if sure. Judith is your friend and you saw that picture trending on social media and you had to upload that picture, I mean, you were just taking attention from the public in that case. How can you upload the picture like that of your friend, knowing what is at hand, and you upload such a picture wishing that they all come together like that? Doesn't make sense. I wouldn't do a thing like that if you were my friend. Like, no, let's, no, no, you should have asked me. It doesn't matter if she permits no, 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 no. Hold on, I, hold on. I saw a picture that I liked it, and I like, posted it. And you see, you have to understand that she's Judith's friend. Come, can you bring Judy one day? Let's even talk to Judy. Maybe she can share her own insights with us. I'm, I'm open to learning. I'm open to having No, Judy, Judy, is a, Judy is a very private person. And I couldn't want to talk about my friend publicly, yeah? No, so if you want to talk to Judy, you... you you I'm have to DM her yourself and tell her, please, I would want you to come on live with me so we can ask you some few questions. I don't have to be the one to do that for you. That's her life. I don't like, do you understand? Yes. And yeah. I mean, like, and my words are also limited. I, there are things I cannot just open I my...
in the next video i don't want this video to be too long the next video is the main aftermath by the time she now saw that all the tides were were against her she had to bow she had to apologize the next video is where have the real story about how her friendship with judy scattered secrets have started spilling watch out for part two but first i'm going to be posting the um, video she did with daddy freeze so that you can judge and see what kind of friend that she really was to judy this has nothing to do with the case at hand. I believe that probably she was a close friend to Judy. Let's say that this Judy situation was a different situation. You will see that this is one of those friends that they say is do or die, right? Or your, your ride or die kind of friend. So um, she was always defending her and all of that. But guys, watch for the next video. I'm going to be dropping the next video shortly so that we can follow up this story. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. As usual, me, your girl, Asit Zalit. Our bench is our bench is functional at this point. Thank you so much for sticking around with me as i restructure arrange i'm trying to get a, a new mic because i'm going to be doing a lot of vo voice videos i want to be sure that my my sound my audio is really good so i'm trying to um scout for a new mic if you have suggestions let me know your thoughts in the comment section thank you so much for watching me girl. i see dali please check out my other videos and i'll see you next time. bye guys <laughs>